What's up everybody? It's your girl Destiny Moshe back with another video. Today we are going to be doing this fun springtime look. I think it's fun. It's flirty. It's soft. It's not out there. Just something soft glam with a pop of color or whatever on the eyes and the lips. Um, It's spring so let's have fun and if you want to learn how to do this then keep on watching. Pause. So first of all we're going to call this the Everything Went Wrong Springtime Makeup Tutorial. Like, I don't know what happened, y'all. Y'all just got to continue to watch it because this is a hot mess. Okay, now y'all, press play. Today's palette we're going to be using is from Too Faced. It is the most talked about Too Faced Just Peachy Matte Palette. And this is like the perfect palette for spring, summer, which fall. I mean, it's just the best palette for everything and it's all matte. Prime suspect number one. Look at sis eyebrows, dude. Like, what is going on? Who gave me the green light to keep going with this tutorial? But y'all, yeah, I promise, the foolery gets worse. Just keep watching. So, the first shade that I dipped into was Peach Tart. And then I was like, no, I'm going to go in with Peach Tea. It's more of a flush tone color. But y'all, I put this above my crease and to myself in my head, I'm like, yeah, the damage is just already done. So just keep going with it. Okay, so now I'm dipping into Peach Tart, and y'all, it's already a muddy mess, so, I mean, there's really no use <laughs> for me to even keep going at this point. It's over and it's done. Throw the whole face away. But wait, there's more buffoonery. So, I call myself using my Benefit Stay Down Straight Eyeshadow Primer to carve out my lids and y'all it's not even applying evenly like it's patchy it's dots here dots there and then I didn't even carve my eyelid out right y'all I just can't with this I can't I don't know how I wanted this, but flappy flow right here got in the way. <clears throat> so I tried to fix that little mistake by adding peach tart and it didn't work. So I was like, yeah, whatever, let's just continue on with the tutorial. And in the center of my lid, I am taking just peachy to um, brighten it up, you know, make a little ombre three-dimensional eyeshadow look. And then I am adding um, peach tart in the outer corner, and then I'm just applying more just to blend those two shadows together. Fifteenth of all, whoever told y'all that this palette is black girl friendly lied. They straight up lied. This palette is a hot chalky mess, okay? These light colors are barely showing up on your girl. And it just looks a chalky mess. You can see the shadows just flying up and whatever. It's just not doing it. This is the face of disgust. So I'm at this point like whatever, you know, just pack it on as much as you can. off camera and as you can see the first stroke was you all know it was just a recipe for disaster like where is you going you really trying to take off what well, girl that eyeliner is hideous look at it like where you going girl I was really 
contemplating like destiny do you really want to upload this do you really want to show how bad you effed up but then I was like you can't show the good without showing the bad so I'm like you know what I'm gonna just let the folks know like yeah this was a hot ham so I wanted to open up my eyes a little bit so I used this Maybelline eyeliner pencil in the shade nude and it's supposed to be waterproof but y'all as I'm applying it's coming off with the wetness of my eyes so I'm just like how is this supposed to be waterproof and it keeps coming off so I talked about it in the video but I deleted that so I'll just let you guys know the whole thing like was a hot mess and now I'm using Juvia's Place Masquerade Palette and this is the shade Dahia to put that in my bottom lash line. Boom! As you can see, I had to add more because it was coming off. How does a waterproof eyeliner come off? I don't understand. We all know what this is. The Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. My favorite part and possibly the only part that went good is highlighting and I'm using Maybelline's Mega Gold Highlighting Powder. This is the shade Precious Petals and I'm just doing my regular highlighting routine, you know, the nose, the forehead, the cupid skull, and the chin, and of course the apples of my cheeks. Okay, I lied. That wasn't the only thing that went well. Applying this lip cream in the shade Fulfillment was pretty good. I got this from an Instagram based company called Kiss Me Ink, but for some reason I can't find their profile anymore. I don't know what happened, but yeah, I got this a while, probably like a year ago, from them um, in a PR package. As you can see, this part is very satisfying. Like, I can watch this part over and over and over again. I'm really having a lot of fun putting this lipstick on. Now it's time for my Tatcha Luminous Dew Skin Mist. But, we're not going to pretend that these lashes ain't looking a hot ham. Like... They sitting here doing a gangster move. One is pointing down, one is pointing up, and it's not cool. And then you can clearly see the curling handsome smoothie still sitting in my hair. Like, you aren't going to blend that in, sis. But anywho, I hope that you guys like this spin on my makeup tutorial. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and also turn on the post notifications. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.